guys, this is Kanika here and uh, you're watching The K-Factor by Kanika Kush. Uh, today, we're taking the opportunity to actually bust a few myths that surround minimalism. Um, there, I've had the good fortune of working with a few people in their homes and helping them with minimalism. And I realized that they have a few questions in their mind, not just them, everybody that I meet. Uh, they have a few questions in their mind which are a uh, little uh, confusing, okay? So I think uh, today we, you know, start busting a few myths that we are aware of one by one. Yeah, so I think let's start. You know, I have a question. I think when we started off with minimalism, I think uh, this question was constantly playing in my head. So if I have to ask you, the first question would be, uh, is minimalism the same as decluttering? Okay, so the answer is no. Okay, a very big no. Uh, decluttering is like the baby of minimalism maybe, uh, it is a subset of minimalism, yes, but when you declutter, like a lot of you would know Mary Kondo, right, she is like almost the mother of decluttering and amazing, amazing stuff she does and whatever it entails, but minimalism and decluttering are just not the same thing at all, decluttering is just cleaning up of your space around and keeping the things that you love. Now, who knows how much you love and what all sparks joy in your life, right? So, uska fir leke rakho gaya. so no, they are not the same at all. Okay? Yeah. Uh, the next myth that a lot of people or, uh, you know, the misconception that people have, Acha, so do we have to now discard and throw everything away? No, absolutely not. Uh, I think it, it boils down to, um, you know, eventually because it's a mindset, uh, it boils down to what you really need. Yeah. Uh, I think in one of the, the earlier episodes, we talked about need versus want. Wants. I think it was finance, Yeah. Uh, if I'm not wrong. But, uh, you know, when you open your cupboard, you you see so many clothes. And effectively, you typically wear the only, uh, you know, top, the top layer, maybe the top two layers. And, uh, you know, things that are comfortable and things that are, you know, that really get your attention, possibly. So that means the others below the stack are just sitting pretty, you know. Sitting pretty or so, adding stress to you? Yeah, so it's adding like stress. It? I think, you know, uh, I think weight, everything adds weight, weight and it eventually comes up here. Yeah. So, uh, no, it's not about discarding everything. It's about knowing what you need okay. uh, versus uh, what you unnecessarily want to show other people. True. Okay. So that brings us to the Do next. For yourself happiness. Yeah. Uh, the next myth surrounding minimalism is, uh, is it related only to materialism? Oh no, uh, it could be the means yeah. to, you know, kind of get to that mindset, but eventually it is about the mind. Because once you get that switch on here, then, uh, you know, irrespective of material, non-material, everything gets minimized and prioritized. Uh, and it's minimized and prioritized to your own happiness. I think your own happiness is the most important. You know, and then eventually selfless happiness. Like it happened with us also. Like it happened with us. We started with the house and, you know, it just, that magic happened. And, you know, as soon as that magic happened, then, you know, uh, we've been so much happier. It's unbelievable. I think every realm of our lives have, uh, you know, become better. More meaningful, meaningful and Meaningful, happy, fulfilling. better, fulfilling. Yeah. And uh, nothing affects us. And we know how to, you know, minimize yeah. that. Yeah, effect. things will affect you. It's not like nothing affects us. Yeah. But uh, you know how to minimize that. You effect. know how to deal with it because minimalism enters your brain, so you know how to minimize your thoughts as well. No? That's it's a mindset. It's, yeah, it's here. Much. It's all here. It's all here. So you know, uh, since we're talking about it, I think we'll get to the last question, last myth, mythical question. No, is that correct? No, mythical has ah, uh, okay. mythical like that. It has a very <laughs> exotic feel to it. Yeah, so minimalism is mythical. Okay, so uh, do I have to live like this then? You know, if I have to, you know, I mean, is it about living like this minimalistic lifestyle? Do I have to live like this? So uh, again, it's individual specific. But my question to you is. Uh, I mean, the whole reason why do I have, why do we have the, why are we doing all this? Why do I have a page? Why have I started YouTube? Is that, uh, you know, anything that good happens with you, you want to share with other people. It's as simple as human nature, right? So uh, it's it's like health. So uh, it's just like health, okay? Convert it into health. So yeah. do I have to get fit? I mean, it's that sort of a redundant question. Obviously, you have to get fit, right? So 
मिनिमलिज्म इज अ वे ऑफ लाइफ इट्स नॉट लाइक अच्छा इसके लिए पता नहीं क्या क्या करना पड़ेगा बट द क्वेश्चन इज दैट आर ऑल एरियाज ऑफ योर लाइफ एंड फर्स्ट यू नीड टू नो हाउ मेनी एरियाज यू हैव एंड विच आर द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट हैव यू प्रायोरिटाइज एंड अगर प्रायोरिटी पे पहुंच गए हो तो एक एक फुलफिल्ड uh, है क्या पूरी तरीके से इफ इट्स नॉट देन येस दिस इज द वे टू गो है एंड आई विल यू नो आई इसमें चॉइस की बात नहीं है ऑब्वियसली यार आप कौन सा हम आपके घर आके आपको बोल रहे हैं कुछ करने के लिए इट इज गोन बी योर चॉइस एट द एंड ऑफ द डे बट बिलीव मी इफ आई हैड माई वे आई वुड रियली पुश दिस थ्रू बिकॉज इट ब्रिंग्स यू सो क्लोज टू योर सेल्फ यू नो लाइक क्या योर ट्रूथ कि क्या है क्या चल रहा है बॉस एंड सो मेनी थिंग्स यू एलिमिनेट लाइक like that you just eliminate things is not important not important not important so you come to what is important right that's what minimalism does so yes it is for everybody but again we can't for there are too many people in the world <laughs> so one by one so i think uh, that's it for now kuch aur mits aayenge ya aapko if you have any questions that we've not answered in this a uh, little conversation then please do ask or write or find out yourself yeah we are not like the uh, the spear heading people of minimalism it's been around for ages we are just the practitioners of it so we are trying to propagate it as much as possible okay but we would love to be of any help ever if needed absolutely okay guys we'll see you in the next video till then stay safe and cheers bye bye